text razor API, uh, which is a powerful uh, semantic analysis or entity extraction uh, API. Um, it has some similar capabilities to Dandelion EU and also a Spacey IO. Uh, the API itself, daily limit on free requests. Uh, the free request limit for text razor API is 500 requests per day. Uh, anything beyond this, you will be looking at a paid tier. Uh, but this has been sufficient for me, um, and I'm really able to dig in with a lot of analysis, uh, even with the free tier itself. So uh, make sure you go here, uh, sign up, and get your API key. Uh, that will be important for uh, this analysis and running through this script. So let's head over to the uh, Python script and take a look at that. There are two scripts here overall. Um, the first script is going to crawl and analyze a single, single URL, uh, whereas the second script is going to crawl and analyze uh, all URLs that are ranking for a given keyword. So all, all URLs ranking on page one. So like I mentioned, you want to get your API key from Text Razor. Um, and let's go ahead and run this first cell. This is going to install the Text Razor API as well as import uh, the various libraries that are needed, including pandas and matplotlib and others. So we've uh, successfully installed and imported the various libraries that are needed. Uh, we're going to go ahead and run the text razor API key. You will want to pass in the API key uh, that you got from text razor uh, right here, and then run cell two. Uh, in the next cell, cell three, you're going to want to update this, change this out with whatever URL you're wanting to analyze. Uh, so in this example, uh, I'm analyzing one of my blog posts on Google Analytics 4, and I'll go ahead and run this through. This uh, fourth cell here is going to create our Pandas data frame, loop through and extract the entities, and then uh, put them into a Pandas data frame for us. Um, we should start seeing the entities as well as uh, the various topics uh, that they're connected to coming through. Uh, perfect. The next cell here, we're just going to run this, and this will put this into a CSV file for us. Uh, you will see the CSV file uh, able to download over here on the side. And once that runs through, awesome. Uh, so we can start to see the entity freebase. Uh, topics, the confidence, uh, the entity ID, and more. Uh, and now we'll go ahead and run the next cell, and this is going to map out uh, the top uh, 10 most frequent entities uh, in the article. And we can see Google Analytics, uh, Google Analytics again, uh, data, dimensions, conversions, and the various most frequently mentioned entities that the Text Razor API is extracting. Uh, awesome. So that's version one of the script.